Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome for new. So today I am going to be giving you guys who are of my new boxer caps. So let's get started. So this is the outside of the house. Um, it, I just decorated for Halloween. It looks really nice. Um, I wish I could move the house back, but it was already built, so it's whatever. Um, I really like the trail too with a lot of pumpkins. That the stack pumpkins are so cute and over here is a little door area with the pumpkin rocket suit from last year and two candy bowls and the one candy bowl is in the witch cauldron so that's a little diy and over here is the porch furniture which is like perfect to watch the sunset or sunrise it's really cute and i love it and it's not too dark here so that's good but it's really cute overall so right here is the foyer um so right here you can hang up your hoodies um, usually I haven't seen, like, stairs in the foyer area, um, but I feel like it makes it more separated from the first and second floor, um, from the first floor and second floor, but yeah, and over there right here is, um, where you can put your shoes on, and you can put your jacket on, and hang up your jacket, and anything like that. So over here is the kitchen, it's really nice, it is a little crowded. But I like it. Um, my first rustic one, my first time using that oven too. Um, but I did have the stove there, but it took up a lot of space, so I just can't use the stove. But I don't really mind it, but super cute. I love the rustic room. So right here is the living room. I love how it turned out. I love the fireplace, like the orange and the brick together. It is so cute. And it was just one big room, which was really big for the living room at least for me that was way too big i don't know how to fill up space that good so i split the room in half so it was a little weird i don't want to just be square but kind of turn out like that so i put a plant there but i think it looks cute so yeah overall i'm really happy with how the living changed out um so yeah next is the dining room it turned out really nice too i wanted it to be connected um to the kitchen but where the counter is it looks nice, so I don't care. Um, so yeah, so over here is the garage with your washer and dryer, your laundry mat, your bin thing. I can't even think. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, this is the dining room again with the little kitchen rules and decorate it with bats. Um, yeah, it's super cute, and I wanted the living room to be closed off, but it worked out good. So next upstairs, right here, is a little, like, storage closet with, like, to toilet trees and stuff, like towels and soap and toilet paper. Right here is the bathroom. I love how it looks, and it turned out really good. Um, the shower used to be orange, which it didn't go that bad, but it looks so much better with the counters matching for that rustic feel. Next is my room. It turned out so good. I love it. It is fall, has a fall touch, but not too fall. It's more personalized to me and so. This is my closet. I want to add like jewelry or perfume bottles to make it look more closet y. I'm not sure. But it looks super cute. I'm thinking about putting a full bottom mirror in it though. I don't know. So, next room is like a guest bedroom. It's super cool. This room is pretty narrow, um, but I split it in half. So, you have like the first areas where you can hang out with friends, and the second is like the sleeping part with shelves. I love that. It's so cute. And the last room is. It was way too near to make it into a bedroom. I couldn't even do the split idea. So I made it into a little office. I think it turned out really good. I was going to have a storage room, so I had a bunch of Christmas things in at first. But I like how this turned out as an office. It looks so much better. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, make sure to like and subscribe because I really enjoyed this video. Um, so yeah, bye.